New at five, as I mentioned, gun violence also affecting families here in the Mid-South this weekend as cousins were gunned down in Southeast Shelby County. That was this morning. WRAG's Marcus Hunter spoke with the victim's relatives who told him they don't understand why anyone would target the two recent high school graduates. Detectives with the Shelby County Sheriff's Department say just before one o'clock Sunday morning, two males were shot and killed at the Eagle Landing Apartments. Family members identified them as 19 year old Cody Peckton and the 20 year old Jeremiah Williams. But every time you see one, you see the other. They always like this. They always together. One of the victims died at the scene. The other was taken to the hospital to where he also died. Family says the two would often pull into the parking lot where they were killed, sit and listen to music. After the shooting, police towed away three cars. They must have shot at all these cars right here, trying to hit whoever they were trying to hit. And one of the cars they was in. So they just didn't care what they were doing. One woman we spoke with said she has lived at the complex for 15 years and nothing like this has ever happened. She said when she heard the gunfire, she ducked for cover. It was scary because you hear it in all other neighborhoods and then this is the first time I've seen something like that. I heard of anything like this happening out here. This parking lot still filled with glass after a shooting that left two cousins dead. Family members say they're heartbroken because the two had just started to live their life. They, they, they both were some young guys. They didn't get a chance to even live their lives, you know. And my nephew, he was easy going. My little, my little cousin, he was same kind of guy. In Southwind, Marcus Hunter, WREG News Channel 3. And as Marcus reports, that investigation is ongoing. If you have any information, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at number 528-CASH.